It's unjust. It's unfair. So say members of the Greater Bayshore Chamber of Commerce, where a parking meter pilot program began in 2016. First, Main Street. Then meters expand to the local LIRR station. Next, the Bayshore Marina for vehicles of those headed to Fire Island. And finally, meters appeared in lots behind Bayshore restaurants and shops. It's 6 p.m. every day, and all day Saturday and all day Sunday, my employees have to put money in the meters to go to work. The town of Islip has 18 hamlets. Bayshore is the only one with parking meters. Among the largest downtowns, officials promised other hamlets would follow hasn't happened. The business community is fighting back, circulating petitions, suing the town of Islip for failing to direct meter revenues directly into their community, instead earmarking it for the town's general fund. But we'd like to just have that money stay within Bayshore, only be used in Bayshore and exclusively, and we've kind of asked to sit down and work that out and we've been told no. Petitions target the town supervisor and two board members up for re-election who support the meter program. They all declined to speak with us on camera. But in a statement told us many lots are meter free. Meters are the solution to employees and ferry customers controlling parking spaces. This makes it fair for shoppers and tourists. We're staying in Fire Island. And we're just having some lunch here. The town says revenues collected from meters will be used in projects improving the quality of life here for all. From Bayshore, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News.